Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. We have to define the function integer to array and which will, which must accept the integer n as argument and this function returns an array of integers containing the digits of n in their order of occurrence. So now we will take our first test case. So in this test case we have to arrange them in their order of occurrence that is 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So this will be the output. Now we will take our another test case. So in this test case we have a minus sign before them, we will ignore it and print the other integers. So 7, 0, 4, 9, 9, 0. So this will be our output. Now we will understand the logic of this program. In this function bounded to array, we have to allocate memory space for BARR using the malloc function. So malloc of size of bounded array and after this We'll have BARR as the array equal to malloc of the size of int into 101. So after this, we'll have BARR to the size equal to 0 and we'll have the character num of 10 that is 101 and int index equal to 0 initially and we'll have To use the yes print f comma num comma modulo d comma n and then we have if the num of 0 is equal to equal to minus means that is in this test case we are leaving it right so If the number is equal to 0 means then the index is equal to 1 then for index less than string length of the num the index will be incremented so index will be changed to 1 if there is minus sign then in this iteration we'll again have the b a r r to the array of b a r r to size plus plus is equal to the num of index minus 0 so this will give us the correct output and at last we will return the BARR 